What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, and I'm bringing you your daily update on a very special token right now. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. We are getting ever closer to 4,000 subscribers. Smash the like button. You're killing it on the likes. Let's get this bad boy to over 150 likes, and let's jump into it. So you might be thinking, Mike, what are you talking about? Crypto.com, why is it up on your screen? Well, look, the big news out there right now in the space, that Vault Inu is apparently contract signed ready to lock and load rock and roll and get trading on crypto.com now we're going to talk a little bit about it the price and what has been happened now you know that i've covered uh, i've started to cover vault inu quite regularly this token is going insane right now it is making people a lot of money and what they're doing the project and everything they sit with the vault is very exciting i'll leave a link in the description to that video where we talk all about the actual vault of vault inu or the treasury wallet as they talk around now we have had a lot of noise, a lot of people saying this is confirmed, and I'll get to that in just a second. But look, Vault Inu will be on Crypto.com, confirmed. Binance and QCon will be next. Now, I did talk about this on a number of my live streams and videos, that the reason for the migration, and I believe the reason they chose Ever Migrate and why it was so seamless, is there was always something bigger in the pipeline. There was an agenda, a desire, and an ambition to do something slightly different and to be that next Shiba Inu, to be that token that goes out and attacks the masses. And the community that sits behind Vault Inu is absolutely insane. They've been in my live streams. I've been speaking to quite a few of them. The Telegram is always popping off. They're a brilliant community. Good things coming threes. Voltoshi, that was a quote made by him. So how do we legitimize this particular news? Now, Pablo Crow, you might know him. I'll leave a link down in the description to this YouTube AMA that he did with the full Vault Inu um, development team. And it says, I'm proud to announce that we are about to crow. Let's moon it, guys. And it says crypto.com. Now, if you watch the full video on YouTube, they do announce that it is listed, contracts are signed, and Vault Inu will be going on to crypto.com. Now, you know on this channel, we have to have some balance. And we've seen tokens in the past get a little bit ahead of themselves, put so much hype on it, and then it kind of doesn't pay off. We saw it with Terrarium and the whole Binance US thing. This does feel a little bit different because, you know, this feels a little bit different. I've got to be honest, you could tell there was a genuine sense of excitement. You could tell that there was a genuine sense of determination with the team on this YouTube live stream. So do I think it's going to happen? I think it's as close as we're ever going to get. And you know, I always like to be the pessimist in some of this situation. I will wait until we get full confirmation from crypto.com before really saying that this is 100% legit. Now, again, I trust Pablo Crow. He's a brilliant YouTuber in the space, very big in the Vault Army. For him to come out here, that's his credibility online that he comes and puts that. Equally, it's the development team that puts it there. So, look, I think it's going to be really exciting. And we've got to understand the magnitude of this. If Vault Inu gets on crypto.com, then I would say... Qcoin, you know, Coinbase, Binance are all going to follow suit, particularly when you start to look at the volume. And you look at the volume at $5.2 million, $181 million market cap. It's a really nice circulating supply, plenty of liquidity. Now, a lot of people have seen today that there's been some gigantic sales, and there has. I think at one point there was over a 70 ETH sell on this product. So, yes, it's going to pump the volume because people are selling. But what you can see, though, is people are buying this back. People are absolutely buying it back 31 ETH buy 17 ETH buy 30 ETH buy 11 ETH buy people are bringing the price back up and you can also see it lists another exchange going live very very shortly and again all of these exchanges so this will be I think number 13 now these all start to really push your volume through and what do big exchanges want they want volume. That's fundamentally where they make their money. So if you've got a token with big volume, you are going to get it. So actually, when you start to really think about putting two and two together, we have all these listings of exchanges and more to come, the team have said. We have volume starting to go through it in a significantly big way. We've got people talking about it. We've got a huge marketing presence. All of this feels like it aligns and it is absolutely with one ambition, which is big exchanges and to change the space for Vault Inu. So I'm pretty excited. 2707 is the price booking the trend right now, up 5.3% on the 24 hours. So certainly starting to move a little bit. You can see this candle went all the way down to the 2079 range, 
which would have been an unbelievable point to buy back in. You can see it's starting to move again. Now, this does move, and it did move strongly through the night last night, certainly for me in the UK. So we're going to have to really see what this looks like as we get into tomorrow morning. But I'm excited to see what this news is. Is crypto.com going to list anytime soon? And I think if we see that, you are going to see a pretty big price movement on this project. Not financial advice, remember, we don't give that on this channel, but we do bring you all the update news and what's going on. But let me know in the comments down below what you think. Have you vaulted? Are you in? Do you think crypto.com is going to list this project? I'll talk to you in the next video.